Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Why not use certain uh, pieces of news that bring us together? Like, for instance, barring the opposition from running from, uh, for president. So we have here Russia and the United States of America, the greatest country in the world ever. And both these countries bar their presidential candidate, the opposition presidential candidate. They both bar it. Obviously, in the United States of America, this is the process was legal and everything clear and nice. But in Russia, no, must have been Putin. Correct? Correct. I have here five, one, two, three, four, five, six articles. I'm going to use three for Trump and two for the opposition in Russia. No, 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 no. It's not that guy Navalny who is in prison for embezzlement and uh, violating his parole. No, no, no. Not that guy. We got another one. And I want to make a video on that one because she's linked with some uh, interests that, guess what, uh, if you trace them, you're going to end up to the same Al Capone. But hey, we don't interfere in everybody's election process. <laughs> Others cannot. We can kind of. Let me show you. We start with this one right here. Trump legal news brief. Main Secretary of State rules Trump is in, inelig ineligible for 2024 ballot. So this Secretary of State of the state of Maine decided, ruled, that Trump is ineligible. All right? Oh, this is the guy. Is that, this is like thief kind of mouth. Thief. Maine Secretary of State, Shana Ballows, what the fuck? Anyway, a Democrat, doesn't really matter, issued a determination. But the Democrats are the guys in power. So he's the opposition, Trump. But hey. This is all legal. It's America, after all. Issues a determination that former President Donald Trump is prohibited from seeking office again. In blah, blah, blah. So, prohibited meaning, meaning ba barred, banned. Okay, well, that's the first one. Let's go to the next one. Ram -pam -pam. This is from Sputnik. Maine disqualifies Trump from Republican primary ballot over January 6th riot. Okay, well, it's America. Now, let's go to the third one. Trump barred, finally, the right word used, from presidential race in second U.S. state. The former president has been disqualified in Maine. Do you agree with that? Well, if uh, law was, you know, uh, if the justice system worked and all that, yes. Because, you know, in the United States of America, there's no corruption. But in Russia, <laughs> it is. You know why? Because we say so. Now, let's go to the other articles that I have here ready, so I can show you that the Russians are trying to copy us, you know, and Pakistan as well. So, it's Pakistan with Imran Khan that they tried to him up, and they uh, successfully uh, do it, while he is uh, charged and he is in a penitentiary right now, in jail, and he's barred from running, again, like Donald Trump. But hey, if you commit crimes, you should, right? Yeah, okay, well, let's look at this uh, garbage Right here, this is from uh, Agency France Press. Russia bars pro-peace candidate from presidential ballot. Trump barred from presidential race in a second U.S. state. Russia bars pro-peace. Okay, that's she is over there. I looked over her, uh, not that way, in a different kind of way. And uh, I have a lot of things to say because I got... I, connected some dots, and the dots are leading to the West. Through some Zelensky Steins, no surprise, and some oligarch that Putin pardoned, and then he said, I pardon you, but you stay out. And he said, yeah, 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 he got out, you, okay. And uh, then Putin is going to try to help him fly or something, and say, hey, it was Putin himself, hey, hey, whoa, 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 poke. I guess this one did not fly either. And let's look at the third, uh, second one on this candidate for peace. Reuters, anti-war candidate says top Russian court backs barring her from challenging Putin. You see how things are done? So it's top Russian court, right? And where is this? This is the court, right? The Secretary of State, man. It's the cat right here. Determination, cannot seek it. And right here, disqualified minds of state, 
but he's just different. It's just different because, you know, we are, um, we are America and everything here is perfect. And we get to say who is imperfect because uh, we proved with our actions. When I say we, I'm talking in the name of those guys in charge of us, not about the American population. The American population, unfortunately, uh, like anywhere else, more or less, is uh, fooled by the mass media owned by the big interest. And the big interest also help, uh, I'm sorry, they uh, are engaged in campaign donations. No, no, that's not called a bribe. No, it's not called like, it's called wherever we see the similar thing occurring, like here, we call it a bribe. Here it's called campaign donation. Got that? Okay, if you got that, now you know how this system works. Interest, have the mass media, Politicians, the mass media tells us what to and who to vote for, and the politicians are just sponsors, sponsored, brought in front of us by the same interest and say, uh, idiot number one or idiot number two. There's never number three. <laughs> Too many options, but we love diversity. Diversity is our strength, except when we have uh, different ide ideas, opinions, you know, uh, lifestyles, or candidates. No, no, you have either. Uh, this option number one or option number one. It's just the same shit with different names, okay, basically. So you see, Trump is barred. Um, the candidate to challenge Putin is barred too. We are equal. Separate, but equal, aren't we? In this case, political system shows that democracy works and uh, the mass media is free here. Ah, my friends, this is the level, all right? This is the level of our um, political system, but it's okay. We are as uh, the Pakistanis, we are as the Russians, but somehow we are, we are better. I mean, if you think, if you still think that Trump is, you know, this, this uh, uh, how should I put it, um, his uh, legal problems that he's got, justice problems that he's got, if you think that this is just because he's an evil guy and he did some hanky-panky and he must be barred because of that and it's not the other way around, I don't know, man. Why don't you give me about twenty, I don't know, twenty thousand dollars if you have them? And I promise, I promise, 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 I will give it to you tomorrow at noon with three thousand percent, three thousand, three thousand. And I'm gonna meet you at at noon. <laughs> All right. I mean, if you can be so gullible, go and vote and then Biden gets elected again. Don't be a denier now. Do not even try. So, all right, my friends, this is it. It's just um, ridiculous. It is pathetic if you can't see through this one. And again, if we are to say, yes, Trump deserves because justice system ruled, how many criminals uh, are not even um, investigated, let alone indicted or charged with anything? I can name a few and uh, one, two, maybe three were former presidents in the recent time. And I got some more, but they were not. I got a prime minister of a different country. It's called Great Britain. He's a sir nowadays because he deserved that. I mean, he checked mark everything, puck, puck, puck down the list. Where are my friends? USA, USA, Russia, and Pakistan, Pakistan. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth, <laughs> and be just.